Arsene Tarun is three years old. He is very active. He is very curious. He is like the apple of the eye for the entire family. And we, we as parents, want to give him our absolute best. Something that feeds his curiosity for the rest of his life. And we found out that Kansu is the best. This is about a very brave family, undaunted by the need to have to step out of not just their small town, but their state as well. Tarun's parents, Rashmi and Deepak Sundaram, have chosen to opt for the most sophisticated technology on offer, that is the Kanso, and to couple that with the benefits of bilateral simultaneous implantation, so that their little boy Tarun can lead a life beyond boundaries. We celebrate two days after his birthday. We tested him and we came to know that he has severe to profound hearing loss. And uh, I literally cried and uh, we were devastated and the whole family were devastated. I want my son to be like any other normal child. He has to go to the normal school. He has to be normal. That's what I want. When he was uh, around uh, 14 to 15 months old, he was aided and we are doing the therapies. But what frustrated us about his use of hearing aid was his, his speech was not clarified. We were uh, not able to understand what he was trying to co communicate. We found out that it was not sufficient for him. He was not um, the, uh, given access to all the sounds that comes within the speech spectrum. And after we come to sound steps, got the reports of uh, Tarun's uh, unaided threshold limits, they explained to us why we need to go for a cochlear implant and after that without any dilemma we decided that the cochlear implant will be the best for Tarun's life. When they first came to us at Sound Steps, I don't think that they really understood the enormity of the step that they had really taken and the speed with which they took that decision for bilateral simultaneous implantation with the most sophisticated technology on offer because they understood that it aligned with what they wanted for their little boy. So this Bluetooth enabled system consists of the wireless programmable port and the uh, NFS touch software which is on the tab. This wireless programmable port makes me free from, the, from my desk. So I am able to move with the child. I really like the feature of the blue light on it because it gives me assurance that the software, the processor is connected to the software. I, and it is getting operated by the simple swipes and which, may, which allows me to observe child's responses instead of uh, being preoccupied with the screen. And that is why I love this software. And uh, I know that I cannot get lost on the uh, anywhere because it is very simple and easy. He likes books. I love reading it to him. And uh, having that part of uh, a switch on was just amazing. Let's clip it on. Yay, it's on. It's on to Tarot. And now, Tarot is now we're going to, go. to play with something. Let's see what I have for you to play with. Mm, look, I'm going to open this. Open it. What's inside? Let's see. Ah, ah, I can't open it. Papa, can you open it? It's so tight. It's tight. 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 Yeah. Mama, yeah. you open it. It's tight. tight. I'll tell you what. You, you heard that? Yes, I love it. You like it? You want to open it? Open it. I'm going to shake it. I heard, I heard that. that. You, you heard? heard it. Let's go. One minute. Going, going. Beep, 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 beep. Whoa. Oh, it's gone. Oh, it's gone. Go get it. Go get it. He understood that in context. <laughs> That's really good. He understood that in context. And I love the cable free. Don't you? Huh? You can get up and do what you want. I really enjoyed the switch on because seeing Tarun detecting the high frequency sounds such as shh. And today during the therapy sessions, he literally produced one of the toughest sound a hearing child can produce that is shh. This is 
why we did bilateral, okay? <laughs> this is why he needed cochlear implantation to produce this. Amma, you do it. Let's do it again. You might have forgotten. He's very <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> no more. <laughs> do you know how precious this is? And he kept on repeating it and he is enjoying and I am very happy to see that he is producing the high frequency sounds within 48 hours after switch on and it's I am very amazing. happy. Yeah, it's amazing. He didn't even realize that he was getting programmed or, or he was getting mapped or he was getting switched on. He was just playing on his own, he was thoroughly enjoying the session. And when he is enjoying the session, I am at ease. I can do my work better. When we were in the garden, the Tarun is so excited. He likes to roam around and he is a very active boy. He was jumping and we were swinging him and he likes to be spinned and he was rolling and he's trying to catch the butterflies and everything. He was very active, he was jumping and the Konso didn't come off. We are very comfortable with Konso for this reason. Even for me as a professional, the combination of the Kanso and the NFS touch and the bilateral and the simultaneous, I mean, I know that I didn't expect to see the fabulous performance and the ease with which the child has just adapted to his new sound environment. I like to tell other parents the child with the hearing loss, don't lose hope. The best possible solutions is available in this era. So don't worry, don't lose hope. Your child can be like a normal child. Don't give up. Even when he listened to music the first time, I think it just reminded me about how respectful we need to be about a child's first experience to listening. We have normal hearing and as parents and as professionals we're going on and telling about our child to listen, to listen. But when you actually see it, it's really humbling. <laughs>